Meghan and Harry's rarely seen wedding photos mark fifth wedding anniversary. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex's wedding as you've never seen it. From the moment Meghan Markle stepped out of the car at St. George's Chapel in his Ivanchi wedding dress. To Prince Harry kissing his new wife for the first time after their ceremony, some parts of the royal wedding are very well documented. Perhaps lesser known is the candid moments captured by the Duke and Duchess of Sussex and their A-list guests. Who gathered to celebrate on the 19th of May 2018. As they mark their fifth wedding anniversary, look back at the rare snaps you may never have seen. Including Harry's emotional speech at their wedding reception and the slippers Meghan's suits co-stars wore. While royal fans have seen lots of photographs of the guests arriving at Prince Harry and Meghan's big day. Suits star Patrick J. Adams gave everyone a closer look when he took a selfie ahead of the ceremony. The walls of Windsor Castle could clearly be seen, along with the immaculate grounds. In new photos released in the Netflix is Harry and Meghan, and the royal and her new father-in-law exchanged a sweet moment. As he prepared to walk her down the aisle in the absence of her father Thomas Markell. The bride was spotted kissing King Charles in a sweet photo following the wedding ceremony. And Prince Harry shared a similarly intimate moment with his new mother-in-law away from the official cameras. The Duke appeared moved to tears as he raised a glass with his new wife. And their guests at a reception at Windsor Castle we wonder what emotional words he had just said. In a happier image, Harry and Meghan stood on a balcony overlooking their guests with the Duke cheekily pointing a finger at someone in the crowd. The newlyweds were pictured twirling on the dance floor, showing off Meghan's backless second wedding dress by Stella McCartney. Harry and Meghan looked so in love as they watched fireworks over Frogmore Lake. One of Meghan's former Suits co-stars, Jacinda Barrett snapped a selfie of her and her fellow American friends on a coach on the way to the event. They all looked splendid in their finery. Serena Williams also gave a glimpse at the transport via social media when she uploaded a video of her walking to a double-decker coach in her evening outfit. Actress Trojan Belisario took a sneaky picture of her slippers in between the reception and ceremony. It looks as though the comfy footwear was provided by the happy couple as someone else can be seen sporting a pair too. If anyone deserves to get an up-close photograph of the jaw-dropping royal wedding cake, it's the genius behind it. Creator Claire Tack managed to take a cheeky snap of the glorious cake in sight before the guests even arrived. How incredible. Cellist Shiku Kana Mason managed to grab a picture with Bishop Michael Curry ahead of the royal ceremony. Both looked super relaxed prior to their big moments with the world watching. Meghan and Prince Harry are marking a special occasion following a challenging week. Just three days after the Duke and Duchess of Sussex were involved in what their spokesperson called a near-catastrophic car chase when paparazzi pursued their car after a New York City event. The couple is marking their fifth wedding anniversary on Friday. Meghan and Prince Harry tied a knot on the 19th of May, 2018, at Street. George's Chapel in Windsor Castle. The service was attended by family and friends including Queen Elizabeth, Prince Philip, the then Prince Charles, Camilla, Prince William and Kate Middleton. Charles who marked his coronation earlier this month with Prince Harry in attendance, had a special role in the wedding. Escorting Meghan down the aisle after it was confirmed that her father, Thomas Markell, couldn't attend. Meghan's mother, Doria Ragland, attended the event and exited the ceremony arm in arm with her daughter's new father-in-law. In their Netflix series Harry and Meghan, released in December, the couple shared intimate photos of the celebration and the evening reception. They revealed that they did their first dance to Land of 1000 Dances by Wilson Bickett. I just really wanted the music to be fun. Even our first dance, Meghan recalled. Never before seen images show the couple dancing with each other and posing with friends. With Meghan in a halter top Stella McCartney gown while Harry wore a classic tuxedo and bow tie. It was a huge dance party, everyone was letting loose and had a blast. Just a fun night and not stuffy at all. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex traditionally mark their special day by exchanging gifts. They love to do their own take on traditional wedding gifts, a source previously told. The first anniversary was paper, and Meghan wrote out the wedding speech and had it framed for him. On their second anniversary in 2020, they both gave each other gifts based on cotton. Undoubtedly, it was a very creative and romantic gesture as all their gifts are to one another.
The traditional third anniversary gift is leather, as a symbol of something that only gets better with age. While a fourth anniversary is marked with fruit and flowers, meant to represent the blossoming of a relationship and how it ripens into maturity. According to Brides.com, the fifth anniversary milestone is celebrated with gifts of wood. This reflects the strength and durability of your marriage, as well as the strong eternal roots you're putting down, the outlet says. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, would you please help us like, share and subscribe our channel. Wish you happy to see our videos, thank you very much.